Hey guys, this is Dan, aka Mr. Grey, and excuse the gruffness of being a bit lazy the few weeks, but I just read the Far Cry 4 Complete Edition has not come to Xbox One. Uh, I think it's bullshit, but for different reasons. Um, it's It sounds like it's a timed exclusive on car, the Complete Edition, because the content is already there as separate entities on both consoles. But I think the fact that Ubisoft has confirmed this, by the way, the fact that it's not coming to Xbox One, I think it's a bit bullshit because of the hypocrisy of the internet. Now, this is what pisses me off. If Microsoft, I'm not saying, again, I'm not saying Sony has done this, but it sounds like they have, right? It's going to PC and PS4 in Europe. It hasn't been announced for North America, well, which it probably will be. But if Microsoft had done the same, which they do on occasions, you know, you've got Rise of the Tomb Raider, you've got Call of Duty, um, uh, DLC, I know they get early, but they, they say in the beginning, we are throwing a load of cash at this, at Activision, this is why we're having it. But Ubisoft are just saying, there's no plans to release it. You know, bullshit. But, if Microsoft had done the same, you, you the, the internet would explode with hate for, die Sony, go, go do things to yourself in a corner. Uh, not Sony, Xbox, Microsoft. You know, die Xbox, kill yourselves. They... The internet would explode. Sony do the same. And it's like, mm, well done. Slow clap for Sony. And that pisses me off. And I like Sony's machine. I like Xbox. I like Sony. I play them both. But it's it's increasingly annoying now where is the, the inter it's not, well, the internet is hypocrites. You know, saying that, you get fanboys both sides. I, I know that. And sometimes maybe I go a tiny bit fanboyish. I don't know, but... When it comes to video game journalists, journalists, they oh, they are such bloody but so biased. Honestly, guys, there's so many. I'm not going to mention them because there's too many of them. But there's so many gaming journalists now where they clearly for one side. They say they're not, but they clearly are. Because if this happened the other way, oh my god, the internet would explode. Journalism would cry, you know. Oh my god, the horrors of Microsoft. It's bullshit if you ask me. Anyway, I'm not going to keep this long. I just want to say my piece. I think it's bollocks. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.